Philosophers and scientists have long debated whether time is eternal or finite. That is, whether the universe has always existed, whether it had a definite beginning. Einstein's general theory of relativity implies finiteness. An expanding universe must have begun at the Big Bang. Yes, but general relativity ceases to be valid in the vicinity of the bang because quantum mechanics comes into play. The leading candidate for a full quantum theory of gravity, string theory, introduces a minimal quantum of length as a new fundamental constant of nature, making the very concept of a Genesis in the Big Bang untenable. The Big Bang still took place, but it did not involve a moment of infinite density, and the universe may have predated it. The symmetries of string theory suggest that time did not have a beginning and will not have an end. The universe could have begun almost empty and built up to the bang, or it may even have gone through a cycle of death and rebirth. Uh, I am reading an excerpt from an article in Scientific American, the Special Collector Edition, um, which is on the newsstands right now. It's uh, called A Matter of Time, and the article itself begins on page 80. Um, I, I think it's interesting that people want to talk about um, whether or not the Big Bang happened uh, in the same way that they want to talk about absolutes in every way. Um, the article is called The Myth of the Beginning of Time. And uh, I just think it's good to entertain the idea that we may not know everything. And um, a little humility in the face of our lack of knowledge is always a good thing. Thanks for listening. You guys take care. Talk to you later.